Probably uh, isn't. Probably. Is he? Vlad, are, are you okay in there, Vlad? Like, you're stuck in the glue. Oh, he's dead. I think he's- Yeah, I'm dead. There he is. Oh, he is <laughs> but with Goku versus Superman, there. it literally just comes down to- <laughs> There. Now, like, now I got gotcha. you. Oh. There was two things it always came down to. Like, the very first time, they were just like, well, Super Saiyan God's power was never scaled, and it never took answer transmission into account. But it's just like, but before from Super, they nerfed the shit out of answer transmission. So that was the only leg he had against Goku. Plus, Super Sorry, Goku Superman. is just an idiot. I mean, well, they, regardless of that, like, answer transmission was uh -huh. the only, like, leg Super Goku had against Superman, and that was the only way he could beat him. But the fact that Super nerfed the shit out of that ability just takes any other possibility of him winning. And it was like, well, let's scale Super Saiyan Blue. And it's just like, literally any form of Superman can smoke him, even like skinny Superman. There yeah, but like, skinny that, for, like, for me, it's just like, why does that just get to be a uh, thing, though? And again, I know I'm looking at it like this is a person because that's how they portray or something. I don't know. How and it's just you... like fucking. Okay. For me, it's just like okay, this guy gets to just be God. <laughs> that's cool. I I don't vibe with. That's just the way the character was made, and I, I get. I I see why people don't like it. I mean, that's perfectly fine. I think Superman is one of the most. I, in my personal opinion, I think he's a very interesting DC ah, comic character. Damn it! Just the way it's he's the written. It's asking the question of. It's the question of the person with the most power, are they doing the right thing or not? Or do they have the capacity to do the right thing when I, having I, all that power? Do, it's the classic question. It's the classic question of does absolute power corrupt absolutely? And the answer is no, it doesn't have to. That's why I love Superman, because he has all that power, but he uses it because he knows he has the again, like the Spider Man quote, which is I know cliche at this point, but it's still true. With great power comes great responsibility. Must yeah, and if you want to talk about power. characters who just got to have their powers, Spider-Man is a great example. What did he do? Yeah. He got bitten by a spider. Yeah, and then he had to train himself to climb the walls and swing the web. Superman had to do the exact same thing. He couldn't control his powers he, in the beginning. Yeah. He, didn't yeah, he didn't even know about him at first. He, he didn't even know he had his powers until, like, I think in his teen years. So No, not Superman. until after he went off to college. When oh. he was a kid, he was struggling. For the long longest portion in the beginning of his career, he still wore a spacesuit because he thought he needed to breathe oxygen. Hey, Vlad, really? put down the mic, yes. and we'll talk. <laughs> <laughs> but oh, but yeah, no, Superman, Superman hasn't always just been the godlike entity that he is. Even he yeah. had to go through a learning curve. No. Oh, yeah, he had to learn how to control his powers, because yeah. as you know, uh. he lives in a world made of cardboard. Yeah, because yeah, here's the... Yeah, because here's the thing, remember, Kryptonians come from a planet where God, they're completely yeah. normal. Yeah, they don't really show off they have abilities like that, or at best... Yeah, on, they, on Krypton, they have a red normal. sun. Yeah, so they didn't... I don't they're think they're just... Really they're normal. basically human. Kryptonians are basically human on their home planet. The only yeah. difference is because of the way that their I cells guess. were made up. And you know what the funny thing is? The the presence, what is, like, DC's god, the Abrahamic god, straight up said, yeah, no, I made a fuck up with that. It wasn't even me who did that, it was Lucifer that did that one. <laughs> ah, I love that. We, like, mm. Lucifer and Michael were making the universe, and Lucifer wow. thought, oh, well, now, let me make a species that can do this. I mean, it doesn't surprise me, considering yeah. the recent, apparently, um, the, the Phantom Stranger is apparently sense. Judas oh. Iscariot, so that makes it Yes, the Phantom Stranger is Judas Iscariot, the Spectre is the Wrath of God. Damn it. I, I love the, like, the, the mythology within the DC Universe, it's so fun. I love seeing, like, every time they de depict, like, God or the being in the universe, they use just a hand, you know? Yep, just an arm. Yeah, they yep. never, that, they don't use, like, figures like how Marvel does, where they have them be literal beings, they're just like, oh, God? Hand. Well, there's the one above say. all in Marvel. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, and that's... Comic stuff is more crazy, so... Yeah, and that's the, the one, and the presence is the Abrahamic God, that's him, like, when he appears to people, but he very rarely does that, more specifically because he's, like... You know, I was very hands-on for a very long time, and nothing good ever came out of that. Can you really blame him? Like, everything went to shit. Ninja yeah. Veer, I oh, have very... I have very oh, interesting shit. opinions about Ruby and oh, Justice shit. League. Oh, no! If you want a good uh, DC anime... Don't get in the hole. 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 Don't get in the hole.
Yeah. Just I was gonna Superman die no a matter Russian, what. And it's wonderful. Wait, I was... <laughs> I, wanna, I wanna say... Like, as dumb as the Nightlight ship is, Jessica Cruz is my favorite character in DC, actually. Man, I, it, it blows my mind how DC fucked up their own characters. <laughs> I, I mean, wanted so hard. Constantine, no lie. I loved I mean, him in the in the animated universe. That oh, also, yeah, Con uh, Constantine anywhere is fucking great. He's John fucking Constantine. Get Keanu Reeves again for John Constantine. They please. are! Yes, please! Thank God! They are making a Constantine 2 with Keanu reprising his role. Oh my God. Old man Constantine to just talk shit to everybody. Oh like, yeah, I'm a, I, I love the fuckers the oh, and shit. No. I love the fact that back then we used to riff on Keanu Reeves about how he was a terrible actor Whoa. and all that jazz. And now look look at us now. We pray the fuck out of him because he's that much of a cool guy. I have cancer and shit. Okay, Constantine, I have cancer and shit. Constantine, we get it. I've got cancer and shit. I wonder if there's any <laughs> update from Nikki. He said he's updating Discord. Probably. Um, give him a while. Okay, cancer. Okay. Also, Blue That's Griffin, the Blue Griffin, to answer your question, I had an okay birthday. I had to spend like 12 plus hours away from home, one of which working a short hour, uh, like short time shift. And then I had to like. I went brass around the mall alone, and it was like, I had to wait until like 4 p.m. because, um... Logic, how did you do that? The parking lot in uh, the apartment complex, they had to, like, replace the asphalt. Mmm. Haha, <laughs> asphalt. Oh, yeah, asphalt. Ah, oh, Jesus! Well, there I go. <laughs> funny, funny guy. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Stupid thing. Also, rise up! Yeah. I'm trying to get in. Right, yeah. I'm right there too. Also, Ryza, you oh, there I am. you said how can DC fuck up their characters? Yes. Um, I don't know. Ask <laughs> DC Have how you many seen times the recent live action movies? I mean, <laughs> not just the live action movies. Look at the comics. They what have. What I'm getting at. The what I'm getting like the Flash oh, bomb. Damn no, like, what I'm getting at is like the way they did the Ribbon movie. One of their main writers on the DC staff was in charge of writing all the characters. Oh, it's get weird. It. But it's weird because like they did such, they did a really well job with the Ruby characters, but they somehow put a no, dick in their ass when it came to their own DC characters. Uh, no, hold on, Ryza. No, they didn't. <laughs> yeah, no, the, the DC person, DC no. is in charge of the writing. No, <laughs> Ru the, you just said they did a good job with the Ruby characters. No, they fucking didn't. Compared to DC. <laughs> but like, but, but Ryza, here's no, the thing. When it okay, comes to so you're telling me that Ren and Nora being fucking abrasive and on the rocks just so that can be a love triangle with fucking superman fucking, with no with cyborg. cyborg you're trying to tell me that that was good writing what i'm saying okay let me correct myself i think the writing of the ruby characters were much better than the writing of the dc characters i'm not I, that both both of them aren't good but if i had to pick between one or the other i'm picking the ruby characters because they were i mean that's like that better that's like making the choice between pancreatic and kidney cancer it's yeah. picking your poison, basically. <laughs> yeah. Um, but Ryza, they they like. Let me let me finish this. They did Batman so fucking shitty. No oh, one can yeah. deny I that. I hate what Batman looks like. His head looks like his head looks thirty years younger than his body. <laughs> it's pretty funny. It's pretty funny. <laughs> also, and Batman, uh, what they did to Batman, they made Batman unironically say, "I don't want to be in Gotham anymore. I want to be here where I have superpowers." <laughs> that is not Batman. That is exactly. not Batman. No. Um, God damn like, it! But, like Ryza, here's the thing I'm trying to say, and this is something that like <laughs> kind of still surprises me. You're asking that? Oh, how did DC screw up their characters? Wait, DC stop literally it, it. cannot, love. for the life of me, or for anybody, ever actually get it. <laughs> when they do, they yes. fuck up. Look what happened with the comics! Ah, they kept no! rebooting and rebooting and rebooting the franchise <laughs> to the point where they decided they were going to wipe the slate clean oh, it's on infinite Earth, it exists by for reason, yeah. erasing the, um, what was it? They first erased the, uh, the, um, what was it? The multiverse. They then tried to fix that by making other time, trying to refix the timeline. It didn't work. They did it three ah. more times. Wiped the slate clean once again. Everybody hated that Nikki! slate. And then they, oh yeah, the new fifty-two. Guys, and all that. Yeah, they, wiped, they wiped that I slate. Lose. Right of death. 
No, no, crap. Oh shit, sorry. No. Go on. No. 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 Hey, hey, Nikki. Hey, What's hello. up, guys? I am sorry. I it got very happened. passionate. <laughs> It's Nikki, you, Nikki, it's been forever. I missed you. Yeah. Oh, thanks, guys. I don't know Aww. who you are, but it's nice to meet you. He, he, was a fun, he was a fun dude to talk with uh, during the the peak of MLP. Hmm. Nikki, Ooh. Nikki's an OG. He's a real one. He's off the. He's from the streets. Oh man, that is literally the first time anybody has ever said that about me. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, listen, it's like seeing Ryu in Street Fighter. You go, it's Ryu on the streets. Can <laughs> you guys stop fucking gank squatting me and try, you know? I to. Gank squat him harder. Yes, you are. You fucking. <laughs> Joker, you literally just jumped at me in the first thing. The fu you didn't even take a breath. I, I was oh, also getting hit by Golden Light at the fucking... same time. <laughs> I'll walk. Just because this when, is a janky squat. When's the last doesn't... time I lost? <laughs> but. Legitimate <laughs> question. <laughs> No, 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 no. Okay, I didn't get a chance to get the gun. No, I think you like the consequences of your actions. But like I said, the point I'm trying to get that is that, no, DC at times can't even write their characters right. But I will point out, they at least do a much better, a much more better job than Marvel does. Yeah, but the only place they can write them right is like in animated form. Yeah, also, to be, like, also, Death, to be fair, DC doesn't have the issue of only caring about one female like character. Oh, no. Oh yeah, Just, unfortunately when it comes to DC, they seem to care more about okay, Batman yeah, no. than every other character they have! Because, can I, Matt, can I just because he's a motherfucking worse. Batman! Guys, can I just I'm make Batman. him shoot? Sorry. Have you heard? I'm Batman. <laughs> <laughs> now listen, I will say this. I will say this. In terms of DC, DC has oh. made a mockery of themselves most recently, especially with The Flash. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh my god, god, the flash is hilarious. Shit. All I will say is that it is a parade of corpses. Who I could mean, have seen that coming? I mean, <laughs> it, I mean, the movie was dead on arrival the minute that they kept insisting over and over again, oh yeah, we're gonna have Ezra Miller in there. Even though well, they had already finished was... shooting most of the movie by that point when he got in We're locked in. in. We're yeah, locked in. I heard something very interesting about that movie, and I found, out, I found out why they kept Ezra Miller in. And it's, to me, it's really funny, but I'm not going to say it because people who, people who want to watch it still... I mean, I don't think any of us are like, the six it. people in the world? I mean, the <laughs> chat might watch it. I'd like ha- that. Listen, I would happily talk about The Flash right now. Okay. If anybody wants to talk about the Flash movie, I want names. I want to see who is on that list. I want to see who's in in support sugar, sugar. of the Flash. Because I've because I mentioned because I mentioned nope. way beforehand that there's a cameo in the movie that pissed off everybody, especially considering the fact it was released on a particular anniversary of their past. Yeah. Dude, there were multiple down. ones in there. There were four people in there that was a cameo. And do you know, mm. like, everybody was mm. pissed about mm. because Damn they it. didn't ask. I, yeah, well, I, 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 I feel like I should just finally spoil who this one cameo is. And I feel like no one's going to watch Flash. So should I just finally up and say it? If you don't do it, I will. Alright, so, the cameo they had, George Reeves, the first Superman. Right. That's weird. Yeah, I they literally included, like, a oh, digital geez. cameo of him, and- It was a CGI- did... it was a CGI homunculus. Yeah, oh, they, they faked that. him. They got Christopher Reeves' ghost to play it. Oh, ew. I hate Fuck that. Ew. Fuck no. That is... no. Oh, God. It's, it's the like, same thing they fucking did with Carrie Fisher in Star Wars. Yeah, it's oh. to a point where it's just like, can, can, <laughs> can, can, can these actors just rest at peace, you know? Oh, they did the same thing with Adam West. Adam West was in the movie. Um, oh, yeah. Happy birthday, Golden. Take yourself something nice. Adam West. Yes. I did. Yeah, they, George Clooney. I, thank you, Jeff, for right the uh, for the donation. <laughs> Um, uh, also, no I have to ask because I saw the trailer. Did they show the Michael? Did they actually have the Michael Keaton Batman? Yes, they have Michael Keaton in the movie. Yes, yes. Okay, the Michael well, Keaton Batman is hilarious. the main. Yeah, the Michael Keaton Batman is the main Batman. But yes, they had a. Uh, oh, excuse me. They had a. Uh, they had oh, Christopher shit. Reeves. Nope, nope. They had George Reeves. They had Adam West. 
And then they also had the old, like, 50s Flash. And everybody was, like, going up to him and be like, Hey, man, we loved you in the Flash. And he was like, I was never in the Flash. What the fuck are you talking about? And they had taken a CGI version of him and put it onto a goddamn homunculus. <laughs> no, we got Ezra Miller being, like, praised by a bunch of people who are dead and digitally recreated for this person who's very troublesome in real life. Here's the thing, correct. Though. I've heard of. I don't know how I would feel if I was dead <laughs> and I knew my image was. Used <laughs> they were trying to go through that again. That, you know. Hey, uh, okay, well, before I can walk again. Meanwhile, somebody is stuck inside the crevice again. <laughs> it's so, like he, he claims yeah. it's gonna work again. Here's my yeah, thing. Right? I've heard the movie was good, but but based on that, I have heard no one. I've heard no one talk about Ezra Miller being good or bad in the movie. Come I've, on, just heard, the movie. I've just <laughs> heard. Oh, the oh no! Stop that movie. movie. <laughs> The movie is okay oh, in no, terms no, of visual like... aesthetic on anything that isn't focusing on the Flash, but here's the problem. Supergirl's role is completely pointless. Michael I Keaton have... Batman is completely pointless. <laughs> because the whole the whole plot is a contrivance to elevate this stupid, self-centered, self-arrogant version of Barry to new heights. Because here's the thing. Uh, oh, shit. Oh, shit! You remember the... You remember the famous line, It was me, Barry. It was yes. me, Barry. That's not in this movie. I jerked you off a of supersonic speed? <laughs> why? Why would they not have that famous line of the fl of like Reverse Flash literally telling Flash, it Reverse Flash well. isn't even in the movie. Then yeah, what is the say. point of doing this movie if they're like, what is the point of them doing Flashpoint? Because literally that's what the movie is. It's Flashpoint. If they're not gonna include the villain who was in Money. Flashpoint, because fuck you, that's why. <laughs> because we can do it better. I do have a question. One more question. Yes. Okay. I haven't. Yep. I haven't seen the movie, but I know parts of it. Why in the fuck was there a baby in the microwave? Oh. Okay. So, okay. So they did. Serious? They did. They yes. did that. They ran that back in reverse. So yeah, it's not Ezra Miller putting the baby into the microwave. It's Ezra Miller hatching the baby in a microwave and then Fuck. taking the baby out of the microwave to give it to the parent, which is still yeah. fucking stupid and nightmare shit. <laughs> it is. What the fuck? I think that's just as worse. And yeah, then people just reversed the footage and had him put the baby, baby in the microwave. What is wrong with yeah. you people? Like, it, <laughs> internet memes, golden internet memes. No, I was talking it's, about... It, well, the, the, problem, the problem is filmmakers don't know how to have fun anymore. They want to subvert the expectations and tweak the source material into their own like their own special version of it but here's the thing if you are fucking butchering it to a point where it's no longer even the thing that it was originally supposed to be then just make a whole new fucking story yeah it's yeah, the same problem it. it's the same problem that i have with people being like well my story is set inside of this universe except none of the canon characters are here and it's not even in the same location and none rules for the system of their magic system is even the same. But if you call it part of this universe, then what the fuck do you even have it in the same universe in the first place? <laughs> if you wanted to write your own fucking story, write your own fucking story. That shit. I'm I'm still trying to process the baby in the microwave. It's, it's sick! So, it's sick. Why are you it's trying to process the baby in the microwave? That's because there's so, so oh, much dude. to process! It's oh, you so want to hear something moral. even... You want to hear fu something fucking even stupider? Oh, but, oh my god! Tell. Really okay, so we know how the Flash got his powers. He got hit by a lightning bolt infused with the Speed Force, right? Inside of a, yeah. a chemical accident in his lab, right? Yes. Uh -huh. sure. To get the younger Barry from the new timeline to get his powers after they failed to recreate the the experiment that uh -huh. gave the original Flash his powers, Supergirl flies him into a lightning storm where he gets struck by lightning, and that gives him his powers. I That's hate this movie already. I hate this movie already. That's Here's the dumb and stupid and dumb. Also, yeah, because my here, here's my question. Frustration, yeah. Here's the question. That lightning bolt that hit Barry originally was made of pure speed force. Does this imply that every lightning storm on Earth is made of speed force? I can't. My yes. brain hurts. I fucking can. I fucking can. I. Fucking can. I
fucking can't. What is <laughs> that? No. Just... Oh, oh, I don't oh, know oh. anymore. I'm. It sucks oh. ass. It's the oh. worst. Oh, you want to know the worst part too about the George Reeves thing? No, I no, would. No, no, no. Apparently, some people that. said that the movie was released <laughs> on the anniversary of his um of his passing. Yep. Which and you know correct. was a was a suicide. He killed himself because of the damage that playing Superman did to his career. Oh, thanks, Golden. <laughs> Oh, oh, so that proper, so that proper fucking scum is. I mean, Yo, they're proper fucking scum. <laughs> but you, okay, the only thing I will point out that was at least, at least entertaining about the Flash, and this is something yeah. I've heard and I couldn't believe they actually did it. So, obviously, they showed multiple variations of Superman, correct? Yes. <laughs> they showed the one Ni Superman people have been wanting to see for a long time. Nicholas Cage as Superman. I Nicholas Cage that. Superman. Because Nicholas Cage been, Superman. Because people, because originally it was said that Tim Burton was going to do his own Superman movie called Superman Lives, and Nicholas Cage was going to play him. However, shit happened, and the movie was unable to be made. So, here it is. Apparently, they're hinting that they're finally going to make the Superman movie with Nicholas Cage, which 